Hi there, my name is Mary, founder of Mary Fenton Coaching. I am a life and career coach. I specialize helping women transition to a more fulfilling job, career, or business. And I know that that transition can be incredibly overwhelming. A lot of people want to make this change in their lives, but don't know where to start. Um, they don't know where they want to go. They know they don't want to be where they are, but that's all they know. And to tell you the truth, that's all you need to know. I want you to know that. <laughs> I felt like that for a long time. I knew that I was doing it wrong. It was wrong for me uh, where I was. And um, that was the first step. That was enough um, to start me on my journey. And so I want to help kickstart yours for you by not allowing you to suffer any longer not knowing where to start and giving you those tools. So this is the first in six the first of six videos. I've broken down the transition of coming to a new job, career or business into six steps. So it it doesn't look so overwhelming. It's not just I want to make this change in my life, but I don't know where to start. Follow these videos, follow these six steps, take the actions that I recommend and you will find yourself getting there. So the first step is a vision. Now I know from personal experience that when you are ready to make a change, you immediately go outside yourself. You look at job listings, you might go on to LinkedIn and see what companies are in the area. Um, you might talk to friends and see what they're doing. You're looking outside of yourself. You're looking at job listings. You're looking at job boards. You're looking at networking sites. But where you need to look in the beginning is within. You need to ask yourself, what do I want? What do I want my life to look like? I know I don't want it to be what it is now. What do I want? And this might take you a while. It, it's not going to happen in one sitting necessarily, unless you do already know, which is great. In, in that case, write it down, get clear, get specific. If you're not sure yet, start exploring and ask yourself all kinds of questions. And they don't have to be work related. They just should be life related. What do I want my life to look like in my vision of, of my dream life? What am I doing? What do I look like? How much money do I make? What's my day-to-day -day activity look like? Um, who's with me? Where do I live? So many questions that you can ask yourself. I have a sheet made up of lots of questions to prompt you and get you thinking, and that will be made available to you as well. But think of this as a vision of your overall life, not just your career. And then you can get more specific with your career once the overall picture is sort of there. So when you do talk about career, what do I want my hours to look like? What do I want uh, my commute to look like? Do I work in an office? Do I work at home? Um, is, is money important to you? How much money do you make? Uh, is making a difference important to you? What kind of impact do you have on your community? All of these questions in the general sense without getting so specific about what role you want. What problems do you want to solve? What does your life look like day to day? What are you doing? Create the vision. Paint the picture of your life. Like I said, this might take a minute, but what you want to do is instead of going outside of yourself and looking at job listings and try to fit who you are and what you do into that, you're going to create your own vision. And then later on, we're going to go outside and find what there might be available in the world that fits into your vision. So you're sort of turning the tables on the way that people normally think about doing this and coming from an intrinsic and authentic place to create your path moving forward. So that's where you want to start by creating a vision, painting a picture, have fun with it, and don't be afraid to ask for anything. Don't think that you're asking for too much or this is unrealistic. Whatever it is that you feel and whatever it is that you see and want, that's what you want to write down. 
You never know. The universe might actually provide it to you. So that's video number one. Thanks for listening.